Okay, for our next beginner step in Foxtrot, we're going to do a pattern that you may have already danced before if you've done the rumba or the waltz videos. It's the box step. The box step by itself can be a straight half of box, which looks like this. Or it can be the advanced version of the turning box, which looks like this. In Foxtrot, the timing for the box is slow, quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow, quick, quick. The timing is the same timing that we've used in rumbo when doing the box step. The, di the big difference is the styling. In Foxtrot, we dance it with a tall, closed dance position, and we do it smoothly. Slow, quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow, quick, quick. Where if we were doing it in rumba, we dance it with Latin styling, which has more of a Latin hip styling, which looks like this. Slow, quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow. So although they're the same pattern, they should feel entirely different whether you're doing foxtrot or rumba. And then of course there's your waltz. The waltz box step is done with big steps, timing's a little bit different. It's one, two, three, one, two, three. And if you get into styling in the waltz, you have a little bit of rise and fall and sway. Going through our other beginners videos, you'll see me use the box in other dances. And every dance, the box will look a little bit different, but the fundamentals are the same. It's going forward with the left foot for the man, Taking a side step, bringing the feet together, going back with the right foot, side stepping together. And the box can be done as a straight box or done as a turning box where we rotate as we step forward and as we step back. And the rotation is to the left. So this would be technically called a left turning box. And in case you're curious, there is a right turning box, but that's more advanced level. Thanks.